Some are calling Edmonton the hydrogen capital of Canada after the Edmonton International Airport announces its partnership to bring five zero emissions vehicle for its zero emissions fleet in the capital region. Welcome to the Edmonton capital region and Canada's hydrogen capital. The new partnership between Toyota Canada and the Edmonton International Airport sees a fleet of 100 hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles ready for use with the goal of 5,000 zero emission vehicles in the fleet by 2028. This region is poised to lead hydrogen. We already produce over 60% of the hydrogen in Canada and Edmonton. And the evolution of these first 100 cars into the 5,000 vehicle challenge is something monumental. The vehicles cost around $50,000 but are currently not available for consumers due to limited fueling stations in Alberta. One of the biggest questions surrounding hydrogen and electric cars in Alberta is whether they'll work in the cold. Toyota claims that's no longer a worry. The, the other byproduct from, um, from combining hydrogen and oxygen is heat. Uh, and so again, unlike an electric car, you've got an onboard source of source of heat. So it's a it's a better option in many in many respects for a northern country like Canada. And for most electric vehicle owners, it becomes a hassle to change habits from charging the vehicle at charging stations and batteries not handling long distance trips. These hydrogen vehicles can travel around 650 kilometers on one tank and fuel up almost as quickly as traditional gas powered vehicles. It's like filling up air in your tire, or maybe more like propane. Uh, you have a nozzle. So you put it on the end, you connect it in and then it fills it up. A minimal carbon footprint is one of the main reasons for bringing these hydrogen electric vehicles to Alberta. The airport says the vehicles will be used to transport people in the airport area with goals of becoming car rental fleets and taxi fleets in the future. We really want to be bold and envision this new future and help create it here at Edmonton. From Leduc, Adam Zicarelli, City News.